longer distance. He's a man who likes to sort of almost uh, go under the radar and steal a lap on the field and just effectively be 250 metres further up the road. No intermediate sprints in this one. No, of course, uh, uh, points up for grabs, save for the tally overall. And Corbin Strong is uh, keeping a mindful eye on what's going on. Belgium with uh, Tour Tones. Um, uh, Tour Dents, I beg your pardon. Uh, looking to have a, a bit of a... This is Jules Hester's actually in Belgium. His uh, teammate who just goes off the front. And an immediate response here from Gavin Hoover, who points scored very well indeed last time by... Let's have a look. They're running out of laps, only five to go. This could get very hectic, Joe. It could, and the pace is so high at the moment. So when you're seeing the field all strung out like this, no one's alongside each other because they can't. They have to be glued to that wheel in front of them because the pace is so high. So we're now going to have four laps to go, just one kilometre left to race. And just for the first time for this whole race, we've seen a few riders swing up the track now. It's going to get bunched together as they're now jostling for position for this sprint. They are. They're coming uh, up and over the top trying to uh, just find a, a modest advantage, if, if at all possible. And it looks like uh, Sebastian Morovedri wants to be very much at the forefront of proceedings. And there he is, just dropping into second place at the moment. But watch the power of the man. He can skittle away at a moment such as this. Absolutely spectacular. Great work as well from Rhys Britton, who uh, wants to be very much part of proceedings. He's coming up, riding the blue line, almost surfing it home at the moment. Who's got what it takes? Rhys Britton is like a rocket ship at the moment. He is doing very well, getting himself in a good position there. That is the sound of the bell. That is the sound of the final lap, and it is Reese Britton on the front. Reese Britton on the front, it may well be, but Sebastian Morovedri wants to drive into this one. He's coming up on the shoulder. He's on the red line. Oh, he's redlining all the way by the looks of things, and he's going to get there. That's the way to do it. Make up a men's for the disappointment in Mallorca. He's certainly done that right now. And the man we picked out right from the beginning is somebody who loves this discipline has indeed lived up to the billing. He really has, and that was time to absolute perfection there. So Reese Britton taking it on there to lead out that sprint at the final of this scratch race. And I thought he was going to hold on to it at one point, but uh, Sebastian Morovedri um, showing his class, showing his experience, and just timing that nicely to come round at the end there and take a fantastic victory. So disappointed was he in Mallorca. And he's turned that around beautifully here.